Hello, I'm Congressman Dan Kildee. February is Black History Month, the time that our nation pauses to reflect on the many great contributions African Americans have made throughout our history. Michigan, notably, has a long list of African American brothers and sisters who have helped make our country a better and more equal place. Black Americans like Rosa Parks, who sat down as a way to stand up to the injustices that she faced. Or Dolores Watkins Ennis, who was hired by the Flint Community Schools as the first African American secondary school teacher. Or Floyd McCree, the first black mayor of the city of Flint. Michigan and America is stronger because of their contributions to our nation. Fifty years ago this year, the Civil Rights Act was enacted. This momentous legislation outlawed discrimination based on race, color, religion, sex, or national origin, ending the Jim Crow era still in existence in many areas of the country. The bill finally provided African Americans and other minorities with the dignity and protections they are entitled to, but have so often been denied. While the Civil Rights Act moved our country on the path forward toward a more perfect union, there is still much more work that needs to be done. We must ensure that the fundamental right of our democracy, the right to vote, is protected. No one's rights should ever be denied because of undue burdens at the ballot box or excessive lines at the polls. Congress must act to renew and strengthen the protections of the Voting Rights Act to guard the most fundamental right in our democracy, the right to vote. We must ensure that our children and our children's children have access to equal opportunity in every aspect of our society, from education to employment. We must ensure that our government is working for everyone, of every creed, not just a select few. Certainly we continue to face injustices, but as Dr. King reminded us, the arc of the moral universe is long, but it bends toward justice. This Black History Month, I hope you join me in celebrating our country's proud and diverse history. Together, we can all work toward a better, more just future. Thank you.